trees. <laughs> nice relaxing walk with Ellery May. <laughs> Do you like that? You kicking the ball? Go on, go on. <laughs> this is not a game. So it feels absolutely ages since I have picked up the camera and actually said hi. So hi. <laughs> I think I've just been out of sorts a bit since we got back from our holiday. I think I've done one vlog since and I don't know, I've just picked up the camera at odd moments, but yeah, it's just felt really bitty and bobby. So I'm trying to kind of pull it all together now, I suppose. So yeah, today is Wednesday. On Monday, Ellery had her 16 week vaccinations, which were absolutely horrendous and she seemed okay it's like first of all like initially after them and um, she was a little bit sleepy had like a two hour nap and she, yeah she seemed fine really just a bit sleepy but then she woke up at two in the morning just screaming at the place down and uh, she had a fever even though I had kept on top of her cow pole. She had a fever of 39.4, which wasn't great. Um, and she was just beside herself, bless her. Um, I gave her some more cow pole, managed to bring the fever down to I think 38.2, I think. So nearly back into kind of normal ranges yeah she was just really unsettled um i gave her a bottle which she absolutely sunk down but she didn't end up going back to sleep until about half past four and then she woke up screaming again at seven and just for the rest of the day yeah she just was not herself just sleeping for two to three hours at a time 
it was starting to go off her bottles she was having like one ounce and then falling asleep so yeah bless her heart she <laughs> was not a happy chappy at all like she wasn't smiling or talking or anything like she usually would and didn't have any interest in doing anything other than just lying there or being held and being cuddled which was quite nice because she's not done that for a while she's quite independent now and doesn't really want to be held and she wants to lie down on the floor and, and play with her activity gym and stuff or she wants to sit up but she can't quite do it yet so she gets really frustrated but yeah she's been a lot better today uh we went to tiny talk i wasn't sure if i was going to take her based on how she was yesterday but after her big sleep she woke up with big smiles and she was um talking and things so i thought i'll give it a go and yeah after 20 minutes she had had enough and she was rubbing her eyes and things but i'm glad we did go at the end of the day i've paid for it so <laughs> You know, on maternity wage, I don't want that going to waste. Managed to sort my maternity pay, finally. I went into school on Friday to talk about returning to work. <sighs> and I think I've decided I'm going to be going back four days, but they're going to give me a breakdown on what I would be paid if I worked three days, four days or five days, just so I can see the difference, but with the cost of everything at the moment i think i'm going to have to do four days i'm just i'm refusing to go back full time uh we will just have to make do without that day a week pay that we'll be missing out on we'll have to i don't know quick takeaways or something because i want the additional time with ellery i don't want to be working a full week by the way, my hair looks really greasy. I promise it's not. It's because I got caught in the rain on the way back from Tiny Talk. So yeah, it's just gone all shiny. And to be fair, it always looks shiny under the spotlights in the kitchen. And that's pretty much everything caught up, I think. We've got baby sensory tomorrow. So I'll bring you along with that. And Saturday, we are going to the Halloween farm. So I will bring you along with me then. And then I'll probably end this really random vlog <laughs> and just start afresh and get it going how it should be. But I'd really appreciate it if in the comments or if you can DM me on Instagram or whatever and let me know what sort of videos you do like. Like, do you prefer the kind of dipping in and out of like, my life over a week or two weeks in this case maybe verging on three weeks i just don't know where the days go um or do you prefer just full-on days in the life do you prefer me just sitting down and talking to you about things like talking to you about specific things on motherhood or how to help with things specific things to do with the baby um yeah if you could let me know what sort of things you do like or if you like it all or if there's something in particular that you don't like and would like me to stop doing um i'm still trying to kind of find my feet with my channel and figuring out what i should upload what i shouldn't upload i don't want to like waste my time uploading things that you don't want to see so then i can put more effort and time into things that you do want to see because it does take time and it does take a lot of effort but I love doing it at the same time I just see this as my hobby and I love you know how we're starting to form like a little community and how there are so many of you that come back and watch my videos and stuff which I'm really grateful for and I just like how I'm documenting you know motherhood and Ellery's life so I've got things to look back on because otherwise you do forget and in those very early days I was constantly taking photos, taking videos and things and now she's like four and a half months old. I do forget the days just go by and you're not really doing anything sometimes but then I think I, I still want to document those moments, just those, even if it is just lounging around the house, it's documenting these little milestones that she's doing. I mean she's probably changed so much but yeah, if you could let me know, that would be great.
Is that comfy? No one to concentrate a lot. Thank you. 